this is a, a major lesson for all of us. 45 seconds. 45 seconds turn the homeowner to homeless. 45 seconds turn kids who have parents to orphans. 45 seconds turn men and women into widows. 45 seconds turn people who own businesses to jobless. 45 seconds. Now we understand the hadith of Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Wallahi, you feel like, listen to this hadith. من أصبح منكم آمنا في سربه معافا في جسده عنده قوت يومه فكأنما حيزت له الدنيا بحذافيرها Whomsoever wake up in the morning and have three things and now we feel it he's safe in his house he is healthy and he has provision for one day Rasulullah Sallallahu said, this person as if he owns the whole dunya. And isn't that true? Wallahi, think about it. This person who in 45 seconds lost everything. You think while he was running, holding his son down the stairs, he's thinking about his gold and silver and car and, 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 and luggage and bag and all that stuff that he owns and is very expensive. Wallahi, he was not thinking of nothing except survival. So this is a lesson for all of us to come back to Allah Azza wa Jal. As these people had no clue the night before, had no clue it will be their last night. They have no clue they will become homeless. This could happen to all of us. But unfortunately, Akhwan, we do not learn from, others, from other people's tragedies and hardships. This is, this is the whole idea, is for me and you to learn and come back to Allah Azza wa Jal. If you are dealing with anything of haram, stop it instantly. If you are delaying your salawat, make sure you come back to the salat and pray every salat on time. If you are disobedient to your parents, make sure you fix that relationship. Any kind of sin that you are committing, the smoking, and this is something on the side, but this is unbelievable lately. Smoke shops, Muslims owning smoke shops. What's wrong with you?